we're going to be doing the part two of the fishing video of like the gear I use and everything. So now today, I'm going to have a few helpers, my brother and sister, they can't go on YouTube, so I'm going to have to blur them out if you see the blurs. That's why they're there. So we're going to be going over my fishing gear and be testing out here. So I'm just looking at it. So, all right. All right. So the first piece of equipment. Oh, got stuck to the shoe. All right. First piece of equipment. My bag. As you guys know, I already had that one earlier in the other video. So now, so now the next piece of stuff, which you guys already know, is the tackle box, which we went over. Check out the video before then. Lay that right on top of there. All right. So up next is fishing pole. You guys already saw this one. It's the Blues HS1 hypersonic speed stick with the Blues hypersonic speed spin hypersonic HS1 um, reel. So that I'm just gonna lean against the shelf for now, and once we get another piece of stuff out, then we can lean that somewhere else. So, so now we got the chair. Wait, wait. Casing down here. I grab the chair. Perfect. It's a good chair. It's just fold it. It's got a good cup holder. Oh, sit there. Grab the reel. And... Whoopsies. Cast away. So this hit over here. It's, it's tall pole. So there's the chair. Let's see what we got next. All right. Next up. camera equipment put that down in the bag we're all geared up I got more inside but we'll show you later in the video all right so then we got binos a ruler or tape measure 10 foot tape measure and the weatherman just in case if you need all that stuff you can throw that right in there and you can also like, just clamp the um, thing right there and tape measure and these binos, binos have uh, straps you can hold them and hook up into them and they work. They're not the greatest binos because they're like kid binos, but they still work. Alright, so then next up we got this notebook and pencil. It will probably be a pen sometimes. Um, but yeah, so it's pretty much all the gear. I should have a successful hunt if hunt, a successful fish if I um, use all this gear and take it down to this fishing spot and get her going. I still gotta post a fishing video that I did. It's just been I can't get like the video of my GoPro onto my computer. I don't know why, but cameras and stuff like that, they're not easy to deal with, so it'll be alright, but that's, can't, or that's the stuff right here, and now we'll get the video of me putting it in the bag, so we'll go on to that next. Alright, so now that we got everything here, we're going to gather it up in the bag, and I actually haven't tried putting this tackle box in this baggie, so this is going to be fun to see how it fits. Now, if we bring open the big pouch here, and we bring the tackle box in there, fits perfect. Then you also can bring the notebook, throw that in probably in the back, because we're going to be needing that less. You've got to have all your tackle in the front, so then when you're when you get to the spot, you're ready to go. And once you get in, once you get that all in, I would say that pouch is probably good for me because I don't have much. Um, I gotta 
figure out this whole pole situation. I don't even know if I'll be using this chair all the time. I'll probably use my brother's smaller chair, so... No, I won't get that out. Actually, yeah, we'll get it out. We'll be right back. Alright, so now we got the blue chair. I don't want to take it out of the case because it's a pain in the butt to put these chairs in cases. So, so, if you just put the zipper up like that, that should fit pretty darn well for the hike there. So I'm going to be walking there. Be a bit of a hike for me, which is fine. So then put this stuff in the front here, and the vinyls, and put all that stuff up there. Okay, probably put the pencil or pen in there too. And so this um, rod breaks in half here. I'm not gonna do it because it's a pain. But then you just strap it on here and oh yeah, that ain't gonna work too well. I'll have to figure out something. I'll either have to hike with that walking on there or what I'm gonna do, but I'll figure it out. So then that can just get strapped right on there where the gun would normally go. And it fits. It works. So either that or I'm just going to have to carry my pole and um, thing here. So we'll see what happens. So we'll see what happens. And do you want, we'll Brielle, what? do you want mayo on your sandwich? So then yeah, anyways, we got the hat, Let's go over the gear again, like fishing gear and stuff. Well, we already went over all that, but like clothes. We got the hat, sunglasses, the shirt, the shirt under this, or the, like the plaid shirt, but it's not really plaid. Jeans, the belt, and the cowboy boots. So, it's a wrap for that the video here, plus that vest inside. But that's the end of today's video. So, hope you guys enjoyed it and. As always, keep hiking, keep fishing, keep hunting, keep walking, just keep doing all the outdoor stuff you guys can, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you later.